Oh, damn. Hi, oh, yeah. We're almost done this game. I ain't gonna lie. We got like, um, how many days? Um, I counted uh, at least four more days on the calendar. Anyways. Uh, Coachella organization reminds uh, parents not to allow their children to attend unsupervised. Uh, Rochelle Florencia confirmed to perform at Coachella 2020. Ah, Rachel. I keep saying Rochelle. I need to say Rachel. God damn. Sorry. Uh, Gail Naiman and the Marukui Harakami to collaborate for a new IP. Whatever the fuck that means. And who is this mystery man? Sorry, we're not open yet. Oh, Niall, it's fucking Niall. Oh, when do I get to see a new person? Do I get to see new people anymore? Or is that just it? Is this the whole cast we're dealing with? Oh, no, you come very early today. Surprising. Is there anything I can help you with? Uh, there is definitely something that you can do. Okay. What is it? Uh, can we work here? Yes. Yes. Absolutely, Dial. Absolutely. Yes! Excuse me, what? Yes! Is it possible for us to work here? Yes! I swear to God, if I turn this man away, I'm ending it. What? Why? Why the fuck not? Look at that face! How could you say no to that face? Uh, we have learned something precious since we first arrived here, and that is... Communication is very important on Earth. And Earthlings' communication is a very complicated way. Uh, it blows our mind to learn that you need to uh, mix between verbal and non-verbal communications here. Yes, but I can see that your uh, communication skills have improved an awful lot since you arrived. I swear to God. Please hire Niall. This guy is fucking amazing. He's hilarious. Look at him. He's wearing an astronaut. We need to talk about the astronaut outfit, but he's fucking amazing. Notice this would actually improve his communication skills so he can get a bitch. So win-win. That is true. Uh, but it is not enough. Uh, some of the biggest uh, lessons about Earthlings we have learned, uh, we learned them here. Bro, I would, bro, come aboard. Uh, this made us think. Instead of focusing on finding a breeding partner, okay, uh, we should focus on learning how to communicate with Earthlings properly. That's great. I mean, I, I'll still help you get a bitch though. Sounds like a good strategy. Uh, this is why we ask you to allow us to work here. Yes, yes. Because you want to interact with our customers. Yes. This is correct. Yes! Come aboard! I'm not sure about this. I, I swear to God, please let him come aboard. <laughs> let him in. Now, normally if you are uh, supplying, uh, applying for a job on Earth, uh, you have to go through certain uh, procedures before you finally get uh, the job, if you get it all, if you get it at all. Oh, please, I will bend as many rules. I will honestly train Niall my fucking self, okay? Please, for the love of the Lord, let this astronauty ass man be a barista. This would be the funniest shit ever. Let me think this over, if you don't mind. And I'll let you know tomorrow. Please, please. Please let him come aboard. Please, please. I'm about to do just two days of one episode just to see what the fuck he says. Oh no. Uh, we are sorry for our, uh, we are sorry for our spontaneity or whatever. Uh, but it has to be today. Okay. Man, oh why? Because we are leaving for an event tomorrow. You're gonna go to Coachella? Hmm, okay. Hmm. Please say yes. Say yes, you fucker. I will kill niggas. Okay, thank God. Thank you. Thank you. 
but with one condition. You won't be making any drinks. I'll handle that. That's fine. Once I'm done, uh, you will give the cup to the customers. That's okay. Understood. Thank you. Uh, there are other things you need to keep in mind. What is that? Dealing with the customers. Some people come here just to chill. They might come just for a drink, just for a drink, work, or read sometimes. I strongly suggest you let them be. But always be prepared if they want to talk about anything. Now, how can we know whether people want to be uh, left alone or not? This is why we need Freya here. Oh God, she will she will teach you about human communications more than anything. I'm just a barista that just listens to people's stories and eavesdrops. All right, it doesn't. There's not much. Uh, that won't be easy. Uh, but you'll be able to judge based on their body language, which is a good training. Uh, nonverbal signs. Yes, yes. Uh, that will be very hard for us. I know, indeed. Don't worry. I'll give you a sign. Uh, when you should, uh, when you should start talking, or when you should stop. Thank you. Uh, we will need that. Uh, we will need that so much. Well, uh, that's basically all you need to, uh, to do here. Uh, do we need a special outfit uh, to do this? I don't even know what outfit I'm in. Not really. I'll lend you an apron though, uh, I'll, uh, to help keep your suit clean. Can we talk about the suit though? And the diff and the differentiates you from the customers. Oh, and differentiate you from the customers. But can we like still talk about the suit? I mean, like, is, is the is the astronaut suit needed? Uh, you don't really need more uh, differentiating. Yeah, you don't. Uh, but it will make you look more legit for the job. Uh, this is a very earth, uh, earthling thing to do. Yes, it is. It is. All right, then. Are you ready for this? We are. OK, uh, let's start the night. Yay, I'm training in again. Oh, I'm so excited. Do I get to move around now? Welcome, Niall, you're on the job, I know. Holy, where the fuck were you yesterday? The one moment where I beg you to come in is the one moment you don't fucking show up. Holy wow, I know. What the hell is happening? I hired Niall. Good evening, Miss Freya. Hey, Mephisto, what's going on here? I hired Niall. Well, Niall is working here tonight. And I thought I was the only... <laughs> I thought I was the one who brought bad news. Oh, calm down. I never thought this place would be ground zero uh, for an alien invasion. <laughs> That's not... It's not that. Uh, Niall is just helping out. Uh, you've never looked like someone who needs help. I don't, but you know, why not? Uh, there are a few things to clarify, Miss Freya. First, our mission was never about uh, conquering Earth. In fact, it was the other way around. Wait, what? Second, judging from the situation, uh, we are actually the person who is getting help from the barista. Wait, so you wanted us to conquer you? Is that what I'm getting from this? I don't, I don't get how that works. Did you want to stab friendly ties? But. I don't really know. Uh, not the other way around. Yeah, we get that part. But the first part kind of got me. What? Uh, we have learned some things since we arrived, and we came to the conclusion. Before starting another uh, breeding mission, okay, uh, we should learn more about how Earthlings communicate. We thought this place would be the best place to learn. It is. And you just agreed to this? On one condition. I make the drinks. Now we'll only be here to serve and communicate. Fair trade. That's in, uh, what's in it for you then? What? Uh, you're helping them here, right? Uh, what do you get in return? Um, I didn't think of that. I mean, am I paying this man? I don't even think I'm paying him, actually. Cause like he doesn't, he, he doesn't drink. I'm assuming he doesn't eat. He doesn't taste. So. All he wants is communication. So he doesn't. I'm not sure he needs money. 
because I've given him drinks and I don't think I've gotten any cash from fucking any of you. So, okay. Uh, now that it's, you mention it, if there's anything you want from us, please do not hesitate to ask. Can it be questions? Don't mention it. Well, maybe you can uh, be my next story. Great. I can write an article about your work here. Raya. If I still need to write for the paper again. Mm. What happened? The chief found out. Damn. Oh. Uh, is that why you didn't come yesterday? Yes. How did she find out? Uh, you remember my uh, faithful meeting with the higher up in the elevator? Yes. The same thing happened with my chief. They met each other in the lift. Oh, and the higher up mentioned our encounter to her. Okay. Keep going. The chief calls me into her office. Okay. And things went downhill from there. Um, I don't know why would she be busting your balls about that? I'm pleased she would be happy. Uh, she realized immediately. Okay. That if uh, that it was the reason for my poor performance lately. She didn't like it, of course. I'm sorry to hear that. What are you going to do now? I can give you a job here. I'll pay you. Uh, write the goddamn novel, I guess. And after that, hope that it sells well. If not, I don't know. Mm -hmm. uh, we do not understand what is really happening, Miss Freya. And can we like time skip so you can explain everything? Uh, but we feel the immense sadness and frustration you feel. Niall, what are you? What are you, Niall? Are you are you like that um 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 gas thing from Rick and Morty? They don't have a physical body, but they can sense a lot of shit. Uh, how about a warm <laughs> a warm cup of drinks? Niall's getting it. Is it on the house? Uh, not huh? <laughs> you will. You allowed to do that? I don't know. Y'all don't. I don't. I don't see y'all paying me. Uh, we will pay for the drink. Nio, you got money? No, it's okay. It's on the house. Whatever. Uh, that was a nice thing to do. Nile. That was the best thing to do, according to our senses. Okay. It was. So, what do we? So, what do you want to drink, Miss Freya? <laughs> Your favorite. Our favorite? Anything. I trust with your decision. Oh, that's adorable. Anyways, I've realized something about the whole cup of coffee thing. Apparently. Freya's, it's, um, black magic. But apparently, I, what is it? Coffee, mint, honey. Uh, coffee, uh, mint, and honey. But apparently, the whole, um, um, surprising, I don't know when, when we did it, but it was, I had to surprise Niall with a drink. And the drink that he liked was apparently... Uh, a drink called um, a Milky Way or Galaxy or something. It was called Milky Way, but I don't really have a drink called Milky Way. I'm pretty sure I don't. But if I would have gave that to Niall when I was supposed to surprise him, I guess I would have gotten an achievement. I have no fucking idea. But I'm just going off a list on what to serve them because I don't feel like getting it wrong. Fuck you people if you think I'm cheating. I don't give a shit. Uh, here is your drink. Especially crafting by your, uh, uh, especially crafted by the owner of the coffee shop. Yeah, uh, I know, I know. Well, who else is gonna brew it? Who knows? I'll probably train Niall. Why not? Thank you so much for this. I always wondered why your place always served hot drinks. Um, but today I might have an idea why. Uh, how far along are you with the novel? I can prepare the draft in a few days, like I think. Now that I don't really need to care about other deadlines, 
Oh, so you're fired actually? And if I imagine, uh, okay. And if I manage to infuse some coffee, infuse some coffee and creativity in, in, into my blood. Okay. That sounds doable. Even without the caffeine infusion. Excuse me, Miss Freya. But we, but we have learned extensively about Earthlings' hobbies, about all the races. Okay, that's a lot of information you had to binge. And we do not think infusing your blood with coffee <laughs> would be <laughs> advisable. This is why I need him here, all right? This is why I needed this man hired. He's a crack. Uh, I'm sorry, Niall. <laughs> I'm not really in the mood for this sort of conversation. It was just... Niall? Freya wasn't serious about infusing her s herself with coffee. Ah. Uh, oh. We are glad to hear that, then. Uh, that was a figure of speech. Now, see? This is why you need to be here. Ah, oh, we have heard about that term. Is it still very hard? It is still very hard to understand your language. It will be all... It will always be hard. Yes, it is. Language will keep on, uh, languages will keep on changing. Understood. At least we have, uh, at least we are here now to learn the basics of how Earthlings communicate. Miss Freya, if we may ask, ask away. How fast do you write? Not fast enough, apparently. Do you have numbers? What? Numbers? Uh, how many words do you, uh, produce per day? Um, I don't think I understand it. I don't think I have the exact number, but full time, I should be able to write between three and five thousand words per day. That's a fucking lot. Oh my god, that's raw. After that, I still need to edit it. Okay, I usually end up with about half of what I originally wrote, according to our research. Uh, the understand number of words for the, th uh, for the thing you need to write is between 50 and a hundred thousand. Wow. That's right. Jesus Christ. But for this draft, I don't need to write that much. This is a pleasant information to hear. Wow. How many words do you need to write? Let's see. Is this, is this a conversation that we're really having? I think it should uh, be around 15,000 words. And you just pulled that number out of your ass? <laughs> That's pretty big for a pitch draft. Well, this is a GRA media. Uh, the biggest publisher around. If we count based on the numbers of words, it seems like you will, uh, you will be able to achieve your target easily. <laughs> Niall, you are a human calculator. I wish. Writing isn't all uh, only about the numbers of words, Niall. It requires things outside the mere word count. If we only judge writers by their ability to write a large number of words, then we wouldn't have poetry or short stories. That is a pretty hard. That is pretty hard to understand. You need to bring Niall some poems. Who knows? Uh, but we but we learned um, beforehand that art is a difficult matter. It is. Even for Earthlings. I mean, now people are using digital art, They're using AI. Yep. Earthlings seem to have a fascinating, a fascination for things which are hard to understand. From languages to art. Right again. Uh, but you're not the, uh, but you're not that wrong about writing, you know. Word count is one of the few things you can objectively judge a story by. It's not the most important thing, but it's still up there. So, it, uh, so is it still a valid uh, pyramid? Uh, parameter? Uh, whatever. Definitely. Cool. <laughs> oh, this guy. <laughs> this guy. That that didn't sound at all like you, Nile. I guess you really are learning something on Earth. Great! Who is this guy? 
Oh, another guest. All right, we're gonna guess this guy. Um, we, who haven't we met? We haven't met Jorge, Gail. Um, we haven't met Lao. Um, we're going Gail. Ne <laughs> All right, you. All right, it's Mai. Good evening, Miss Mai. Hmm. Yeah. What the fuck are you looking at? I won't even ask. Don't. I know you're staring at Nile. Don't worry about him. <laughs> Except for one thing. Who's making the drinks? Me. I'm still the one responsible for that. Good. Uh, coffee with a little bit of ginger, please. Uh, is that just coffee, coffee, ginger? Yeah, it is. All right. Whatever the fuck that name is. Oh, Jahi. Oh, wait, we already made this drink. No, we did not, apparently. We did not make this drink. This is a new one. Gender precise with the ground. Okay, whatever. I don't really read this, so fuck it. Uh, your order is... is <laughs> I forgot that I was serving it. Uh, your order is ready. Oh, take it. Not bad. Thanks. You are welcome. See, it's fine. What brings you here today, Miss Mai? Psst, Nile. Some people come to the coffee shop just to sit without telling, without being disturbed. Oh, that definitely seems uh, seems fit for Miss Mai's visit here. <laughs> Actually, I'm not here just to sit without being disturbed. Oh, ah. See, even I get it wrong. Nile, even I get things wrong. You know, it's fine. Part of us. Uh. I was just uh, training now in how to talk with a customer here. I can see that. Uh, you're still trying to get laid? <laughs> no, apparently he's not, but I'll still help him. Er, <laughs> oh, no, we are not. Uh, we are taxed with learning how Earthlings uh, communicate with each other. Yeah, that's a step in the right direction. One suggestion, if you, if you want to blend in with us, Stop using such formal language. Start talking uh, the way we talk. Start listening the way we listen. Which essentially is not really uh, uh, listening at all. Ah. Uh, that would be very difficult to achieve. But we still try. Step by step. Uh, one small step for you. One might be one be a giant leap for your kind. You joker. <laughs> that was nicely said, Miss Freya. <laughs> By the way, Miss Mai, now that we know you are not here for your usual activities, are you here for someone then? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Aqua. Oh, is it Aqua? Uh-huh. Uh, that was occasion. Uh, what's the occasion? No special occasion. It's just... And here we go! Who the fuck is that? Oh, wait, yeah, I can know that's sloshing anywhere. Hi! I'm sorry. I'm late. I was supposed to leave early, but... Uh... Well, yeah, I know. What is this? What is... What the fuck? What is happening here? Ah, ba 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 nigga the Fuck! I already, I already told the barista. Oh, uh, 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 what the fucking? I already told the barista to call the cops when he's, when he, uh, when he said he was going to breed here. Okay. Where is Mephisto? I'm right here. Miss Aqua, please relax. I'm here. Oh, you're safe. Yeah, I know that. Yes, everything is fine. <laughs> okay. Uh, please let me take a breath. Please do take a breath. I mean, like, I know he's odd, but he's a funny type of odd. Here, please drink this water. All right, now we're gonna, like, what? Explain the whole reason why he's here? Feeling better now? Yes. I'm sorry. Okay. It's alright, Miss Aqua. 
Everyone has been surprised to see me here. Yes, they really have. What are you doing here anyway? We are starting to think that we might need to make a recording for the answers to this question. <laughs> I love this guy. You don't have to tell me if you don't want to. No, he's being, uh, he, th that was sarcasm, unintentional though. No problem, Miss Aqua. Uh, it's a time for our break anyway. So here's the deal. Okay, another cut, goddamn. Eh, uh, Niall, you, you, you crack me up. That's really interesting. Uh, very nice, uh, uh, very nice of you to do this, Mephisto. I know it is. It's nothing, really. I know. I'm a great guy. But do you really think one day is enough uh, to learn everything? No, it is not. Definitely not. But we do not want to, to disturb this place as uh, business for any longer. <laughs> as if this place cares about business. Hey! Besides, we want to travel around the planet even more. This coffee shop is, is a good start. But we cannot limit ourselves to just this place. Uh, where do you want to go after this? Coachella! I knew it! I knew he was gonna go to Coachella! He's gonna, he's gonna see people and no one says a word. What? Oh, what are you going to do at Coachella? According to our research, uh, there are many uh, breedings happening during Coachella. Uh, dude, I don't think that's the case. And this is why we decided that the event will be our next target. Well, you're not wrong. But didn't you say that, uh, di didn't you say the baby has to be born out of love? Yes, we noticed that. But we also noticed that we need to know a lot more about Earthlings, including the breeding manners. Okay, uh, that is what we will study in Coachella. After that, we will be very ready to breed with so many female Earthlings. I shouldn't say this, but hell, that sounds like the best plan you've had since you got here. It is! It really is. Now you are a riot, man. Should I tell him that there's an agent man looking for him? Because I forgot all about that. We know. Uh, we also surprised ourselves. But please, Miss Freya, uh, uh, let us stop talking about our plan. We will work here today. We work here today. Okay, first let us return to our spot behind the bar. So our discussion with Miss Mai was stopped abruptly. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. What are you two doing together? There's, is this about the whole con thing? It's nothing, we're just friends, you know? Uh, we just want to hang out and talk about our work. Uh, we both work in the same uh, field, remember? Yes, yes, that is, that's it. I don't have that much experience in game development, you see. I thought your research was in computer graphics. Yes, but I've never made a game from scratch before. I always, uh, I was always a bystander. So I've been asked, uh, so I've been asking Mai for feedback from time to time. Today I wanted to thank her directly. I don't know why, uh, but she arrived first. So I couldn't buy her a drink. Never mind that. I'd refuse it anyway. <laughs> but wait. If you wanted to thank her directly, does it mean you're done with the game? Excuse me, Miss Mott. I mean Freya. God damn. Excuse me, Miss Freya. Uh, it should be your, not your. Oh, Grammar Shark. Here. <laughs> ah, so, uh, so you're correcting my grammar now, huh? It was a slip of the tug, okay? I'm, I'm sorry. Uh, how did you even pick up? How did you even pick on that anyway? It's not like what I'm saying is written down anywhere. Yeah. We just know. Back to you, Aqua. So, uh, you're done with your game. <laughs> Oh my god, I feel like Niall is breaking the fourth wall here. 
Uh, there's uh, quite a lot of things I need to publish and fix, but players can enjoy the experience from start to finish. What kind of feedback do you uh, give people for the for a video game? That depends on the game. But in Aqua's case, most of my uh, advice was about the pacing, controls, and UI and UX, whatever the fuck that means. Huh. <sighs> It must be fun to have finished work on your creation. Uh, it must be fun to to have finished working on your creation. It surely removed some of the weight off my chest. Uh, just to replace it with another weight. Uh, you mean there is still more to come after you're done? Oh, why? I'm not done with my book. Yeah, because, you know... I just lost my job. Yow, and if I can't finish the draft on time, I'm done. And even after all that, if it doesn't sell well, I'm even more done. I'm even more done. Double done. I'm sorry to hear that, Freya. Eh, I give her a job here. But please, be more confident. <laughs> yeah, okay. Uh, even I'm starting to doubt myself. I read more, I read some of your short stories, you know? After our first meeting, I subscribed to the Evening Whisperer app. I do too! I read her stories at the end of every single motherfucking episode, because it's fucking fun. It's actually interesting. And then I read some of the stuff you wrote. They're really good, you know? Some of them are better than others. Uh, but it's still an enjoyable experience to read them. So, so I'm excited to check out your book once it's done. You're too kind, Aqua. Uh, what you're going through, though, is more or less the same as what Mai is going through. She got fired? So I'm sure you'll both be fine. Uh, you don't have to talk about it in front of other people. Oh my god. I'm so sorry. Jesus Christ. I didn't mean to. It's just that... Sharing is caring, you know? Oh my god, whatever. You fucking, you fucking kind fool. Okay, okay. Thank you for helping me share with other people. <laughs> I really am sorry. Oh, calm down. I know, I said thanks already, right? But you put so much emphasis on share. That's, that's sarcasm. I know that. Oh my god. Aqua. I'm sorry it sounded that way. But yeah, I kind of get what you're dealing with. Although it's a bit different for me. Uh, what's your problem? Burnout. I've been working on something for two years straight, but no one outside the office knows about it. And those who do don't seem to appreciate it at all. I thought Full Metal Conflict had a new game every two years. Yes. I really don't work on them. Not directly. So, what do you work on? A secret project. I'll tell you under the friend NDA, okay? Alright, I'm not with the paper anymore anyway. I'm part of a special team. Uh, we're tasked with making a breakthrough in the studio. Uh, we need to be able to make a project type for a new IP. Or worst case, another FMC game in a different game in a different genre. Um. Okay, is that the shit I saw in the paper? Uh. Isn't that a dream job for pe some people? I have no idea. Heh. <laughs> uh, that's what I thought at first. Uh, you're a writer, right? Imagine being a writer, but you can't publish anything you write for years. Yeah, I can see how that's bad. That doesn't sound like a pleasant situation at all. My team has been working, uh, has been making pitches, uh, pitches, dozens of, of them, hundreds, thousands. Out of all of them, countless pitches. Only a handful got approved uh, from uh, prototyped. And so far, none of the prototypes has been approved. Ouch. Uh, there's only seven of us on the team. The seven samurai. That's what they say. Wow, so you haven't released anything for the last two years? 
Sometimes our teamwork uh, is support others. It's to support others uh, when they're going through a crunch cycle. Okay. Uh, they need to hit an almost impossible target. We jump in. No wonder you folks were considered uh, the Seven Samurais. I guess, yeah. That's so fucking nerdy, though. By the way, Mai, I just realized. What? Usually developers get their uh, vacation times after finishing a project, right? More or less, yeah. Uh, w when was the last time you had a vacation? Okay, let me guess, two years? Before I joined this company, I guess. Wow. <laughs> That's like four years ago. Okay, I was two years old. Uh-huh. Dude, no wonder you're so burnt out. Yes, that's why. You need a vacation. But I can't just take one. You can. In fact, you will do it tomorrow. But tomorrow is... I'm not done yet. Uh, you, will take to uh, you will take tomorrow, the day after, and another day after off. But where should I go? <laughs> Don't worry, I'll take care of that. Uh, go to Coachella tomorrow. Meet, uh, make sure Niall doesn't turn into a sex offender or something. You will? I'm going with you for the first long weekend vacation. Uh, what about Max West? That's not this weekend. Forget about it for now. Hey, hey, okay. Uh, but I can't do it tomorrow. Uh, how about starting Friday? It's still a long weekend gateway, right? Hmm. All right. Ah, uh, I'm, I'm so excited. Wow, Aqua. Finally, you're taking charge. You look like a different person. Really? I'm sorry. Why are you sorry all the time? <laughs> Don't be. Okay, it's settled then. I need to go home now. And prepare for our uh, getaway. I'll come with you. Oh, to my apartment? Okay, here we go. No, we'll t uh, no, we'll walk together to the bus stop, just like last time. Oh. Okay, then. Everyone, see you next week, okay? Have fun. Take care, uh, take care out there. <laughs> uh, may you find joy during your vacation. Ah, you funny man, Niall. Didn't you say he was gonna go there? Okay, see you folks later. Vanish! Ah, uh, once there was three, now there's just you, me, and him. Hmm. Vacation, huh? You definitely need one, Freya. I know. But not now. I've got to finish this draft first. As we have said before, you can do it, Miss Freya. <laughs> Thanks, Niall. Anyways, are you going to, clo uh, to close anytime soon? Depends. What? Uh, I'm in the mood for some uh, for some writing. Then please take your time. Uh, you sure? Uh, do you want to order any drinks uh, to be going with you? Uh, still on the house. I don't know why I'm doing that. I definitely won't say no. And cut. What is that? It. And that's it. That is so nice. I hired an astronaut, and they're going to go on a vacation. Ah, uh, I wonder what's today's paper. Okay, the Evening Whisperer is, is with the people for gun strike laws, okay? New healthier furry sedatives might be available sooner. Furies, I keep saying furry, goddamn. Um, action video games, uh, Rising Hell, blamed for violence in schools. Ugh, this shit again. What the fuck is this? 2018? Who are we doing? Welcome. All right, well, we don't know. And we'll keep it like that. I am, I'm fine with it, you know? I, I like that I, I like that I hired Kyle. I like that I hired him. He's a good, he, he's a good man. He's a good man. He's a great man. 
I feel like that this is going to bite me in the ass a lot later with an agent, the agent that's hunting him. But oh well, it's fine. Anyways, I hope he has a fun time at Coachella. I hope he gets a lot of puss. It's either that or I'm going to see him on the newspaper as a sex offender. So who knows? Anyways, I'll play all out uh, while I read the evening whisper.